Yo, what's up guys? It's DIY Scott. I'm out here with my boys today in the man cave. And today, we're going to teach you how to make hook and ring. Oh, nice. Let's see how it works. Works don't have done. Boom. That's it. You want to see how to do hook and ring? I'll show you how to do hook and ring. All right. Uh, let's break down how to make the hook and ring. Pretty simple. I uh, went to the hardware store, picked up a small piece of wood, cut it down into, I think it's about two feet, six inches total length. It uh, gives you enough space for your wood dowel, your hook, uh, the bottle opener, and of course, the magnet. Um, pretty simple. You're going to drill a hole at the top at a slight angle. Um, that's going to give the depth of this that you need as it goes upwards. Um, you're going to drill a small hole on the top. Um, I used some fishing string to thread through there and then pull the string through. I made a knot at the top. Uh, pretty simple. I, I picked up this ring. See the one that um, I have? It's a little bit uh, darker. There's lots of styles, but I was going for a little more rustic look. Um, again, you're going to tie the string on there. Uh, it'll take some playing around to get it at the right length. Um, you'll also see the hook, which I tried a bunch of different hooks. What I like about this hook is it's coated, and it really takes away some of the annoyance of the cling when you hit metal to metal. Um, then I picked up a bottle opener. I think I got a pack of six for about ten bucks, super cheap. And then I added this magnet on the bottom, which is awesome. So when you're opening your bottles. Uh, the man magnet or the caps just fall and stick on the magnet. Pretty sweet. Um, so I hope you like this. Uh, total cost for this project was about five dollars and sixty cents. Uh, so I hope you enjoy. 